Admittedly, it was a bit of a stretch of the state's new industrial development theme to push aircraft carriers and the nuclear attack submarines as made in Virginia, but nobody seemed to mind, especially the shipyard workers who were being spotlighted in today's promotional visit. Governor Robb toured the yard this morning for a quick look at the carrier Theodore Roosevelt and the submarine Olympia. With a dry paintbrush, he splashed away at the campaign's logo painted on the starboard bow of the sub. Although the slogan is aimed at encouraging consumers to buy local products, there was no suggestion that the state's largest employer was going into the boat building business. Nonetheless, the governor pointed out that almost one-third of the component parts and materials that go into these ships are Virginia products. He also touted the stabilizing effect all the new government contracts will have on the local economy and the workers. And there's a prospect for uh, additional employment during the uh, next uh, two or three years that may go up another 1,500 or 2,000 employees. That is if current contracts are completed according to schedule, which apparently was never in doubt with this ship. The Olympia will be launched on Saturday, the 12th Los Angeles class sub to be built here at the Newport News Shipbuilding. It will also be more complete than any other sub in its class when it was launched. In Newport News, Kathleen Bachman, The Daily News.